welcome to my channel IT smart trainer today we are showing you a very important 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 video mailbox data extract into dot PST file in exchange server 2019 if it is informing please like and subscribe my video and press the bell icon to get more up to date let's start the lab so suppose uh, we are using Outlook Office Outlook, Microsoft Office Outlook, and uh, we all know that uh, all the mails are downloaded into my local system, and uh, locals and the Office Outlook use a database. The database name is .pst extension is .pst. So all the mail are stored into the that .pst file. Suppose we don't have any backup of .pst file. In the meantime, uh, my laptop or the desktop where we use the Outlook. Uh, said that system was uh, totally uh, damaged from some hardware issue or my hard disk it's corrupted or uh, dead so in that situation we just mail to the our exchange admin please uh, back up all of my uh, mail into uh, a file so that I can uh, use my PST file so now I just show you how to get uh, mail backup with through PST file so I am using this account smart the account uh, email address is uh, smart at the smartlab.com I just check which database it is using go to more options is using the test mailbox database so that uh, a smart recipient is stored under the test mailbox okay so now I have to show you here is here you can see that my inside my mailbox there is a lots of mail just sign it out now I create a dot PST file so to make a dot PST file we need to go to the exchange server and then we have to open the exchange PowerShell then we have to provide the command first uh, we have to assign role management to the administrative user just copy this command go to the exchange server new management role assigned role is a mailbox export uh, and user account is administrator so this user account is uh, um, this user account is uh, liable to uh, do this task so you can use uh, any user account instead of administrator So now uh, administrator is uh, uh, liable now liable to uh, extract the .pst file after uh, doing this command just close this uh, exchange powershell window and reopen it next I have to create a share path where the pst file store so in exchange server or whatever you, you want if you have uh, any SAN or NAS you can create a share type also over here I just create over here new folder named is uh, back go 
go to properties sharing advanced sharing share this folder permission everyone full control so this is my share so I just check it is open or not ex1 see back is opened okay so my I just change the path to back now I just copy the command oh my server name is also changed ex1 I just copy the command and go to the exchange shell paste it enter so if the command is correct it will take and uh, the PST backup will uh, show in the in that uh, desired folder which we created status in queued is performing in background so now I provide a command get mailbox export request see the export is completed okay so now I just go to that uh, location back see that PST file is configured so this is how we can export the PST file now we show you how to uh, get the PST file in my Windows 10 out I just paste it that PST file into my local desktop at first I just cut it and create a folder under C drive name it uh, smart name this mark and uh, store it over here my PST file is stored here now I go to Outlook go to advanced options connect exchange just go to the outlook I just provide the command I provide the email address smart at the rate smartlab.com go to advanced options connect click on exchange it will get in things ready now change the settings
so in this way we can uh, create uh, we can extract the .pst file and uh, we can provide the pst file to you the user and they can just uh, replace or they can create their outlook with an existing pst file thank you if you like my videos please subscribe my channel see you on next video